Rika rose swiftly in the gang's ranks, and on September 20, 1926, a crucial incident that contributed to his quick ascent took place close to Al Capone's headquarters, in Cicero, Illinois, outside the Hawthorne Hotel. Rika was preparing to join Capone for dinner in the nearby restaurant when a group of Capone's competitors from the north side opened fire from their trucks, including Thompson submachine guns, into the air and at the hotel. Rika hurried to Capone's side as soon as he realized he was in danger, notifying him just in time to avoid being shot. In the process, Rika himself was shot in the left shoulder and gave the authorities a bogus name of Louis Barco when questioned. Following Capone's praise of Rika for his bravery, their friendship grew. Even at Rika's wedding in 1927, Capone acted as best man. Capone and Rika attended the landmark Atlantic City Conference in 1929, which brought together all of the main criminal organizations in the country for the first time. Rika was sent by Al Capone to New York City in 1930 to represent him in talks.